hello my dear student the activity which we are doing today is of class 12th and the objective of the activity is to understand the concept of decreasing and increasing function we require a white paper adhesive geometry box pencil trigonometric table and calculator to understand the concept of decreasing and increasing function take a white paper of a convenient size and represent x axis and y axis as shown in the figure this is x axis and this is a y axis now take two curve of suitable length this is curve 1 and this is curve 2 take the point on each curve draw a tangent to the curve at a different point as shown in the figure mark the point p1 p2 and p3 on the first curve and take point q1 q2 and q3 on the second curve draw the tangent to the curve at the point p1 making an angle alpha 1 with positive direction of x axis this is angle alpha 1 and alpha 1 is now you see it is a obtuse angle so tangent at this point will be negative now at p2 and p3 this is alpha 2 and alpha 3 and these alpha 2 and alpha 3 are obtuse angle so the slope at these point will also be negative and derivative at the function p2 and p3 will also be a negative so we can say this function is a decreasing function now in similar manner take a three points q1 q2 and q3 on the second curve and draw the tangent to the curve at q1 q2 and q3 these are the three tangents at each of the point q1 q2 q3 making an angle beta1 beta2 and beta 3 with positive direction of x axis and see since these angles are acute so derivative at these point will be positive so we can say this function is a increasing function now observation now we will make the angle alpha 1 then alpha 1 with alpha when make an angle 95 degree with the positive direction of x axis alpha 2 make an angle of 110 with positive direction of x axis and alpha 3 make an angle approximately equal to, it is 125 degree with positive direction of x axis you see all the angles are greater than 90 so these all are obtuse angle so now we will find the value of tan alpha 1 tan alpha 2 and tan alpha 3 so the value of tan alpha 1 tan 95 is so tan 95 is minus 11.4 approximately now we'll find the value of tan 1 10 So tan one hundred ten will be minus two point seven four, and lastly tan one twenty five. So tan one twenty five is minus one point four two. Now slope at these points are decreasing, so we can say thus the function. is 
a decreasing function. Now in similar manner we will measure angle beta 1, beta 2 and beta 3. Now you see the beta 1 angle is approximately 45, 48 degree. Angle beta 2 is 64 degree and angle beta 3 is 80 degree. Now we will calculate tan beta 1, tan beta 2 and tan beta 3. As you see all the angles are less than 90 so these are acute angle. So tan beta 1 which is 48 it is 1.11. Next tan beta 2 tan 64 degree is 2.05 and last tan of 80 degree is 5.71. So the values are increasing. So we can say this is an function is a increasing function. Application. This activity may be useful in explaining the concept of increasing and decreasing function. Thank you so much for watching.